What's up YouTube, on this video I am going to show you a new glitch for the mission Survive the Ark. Now you can do this on Gamma, Beta and Alpha depending on the armors you've got and what weapons you pick up basically. But it's a really good glitch and this is the start of Gamma. The reason why I'm on Gamma is just to show you the routine that I use. Now in the first wave I usually kill everything with a boomerang as quick as possible, get myself some points. Turtle Raptor. <clears throat> Let's speed this up now to get to the end of the wave. One more left, and there he is. <clears throat> right, now we've got 27 seconds. Was on the clock just. So what we want to do now is we're going to spawn in some Thames. I went with Dimorphodons this time. To be honest, I shouldn't because they do block me when I'm trying to get up onto the obelisk, which is the pillar over here. And this is the routine I use every wave near enough. I'll go to this obelisk here. You can go either side. You want to jump up. And this was a test one for me, so I was trying all ways of jumping different directions and stuff, but what you need to do is you need to look straight. You want to get up on the final shelf and you want to look straight at the obelisk and then jump. And you'll get up pretty easy. There we go. Straight away then. Anyway, you can sit up here, use your boomerang, or if you had a bow, you'd do the same sort of thing. You want to wait, get the creatures down, wait until they're... Um, only about 10 creatures left then you can jump down and finish them off now at the end of the second wave because I'll speed this up now and start in the third wave the 20 odd seconds that I get to run around you either look for a simple pistol or you look to spawn in some new creatures maybe some aloes, shadow mains if shadow mains are available at this time um, you also want to look for stegos or trikes and spawn them in with the points you gain from wave 2 and then head back to this point. Right here we go, still got 10 seconds left and I'm getting back up on the obelisk now. My dimorphodons there are stopping me. That's why I don't use dimorphodons anymore just for this video. I did use Dimorphodons, but not anymore. I do manage to get up eventually. There we go. And this is where I skip the video forward. It's the same routine I use every wave, almost, other than the fact that I bring in some new creatures, I get more points, so I get myself a gun, a simple pistol, which is, works really well towards the end and on the boss. And there we go, we're on the Dodo Rex, we're on the last wave. Twelve gauntlet times, so this should be pretty easy. Now the Dodo Rex don't spawn in straight away, so try and take out some of the minions. I apologise for my aiming on this. Oh, fell down a bit there. And there he is, the Dodo Rex. About 18, tame, uh, 18 kills in, the Dodo Rex spawns. 
And as you can see, the simple pistol is quite powerful against him. The aloes are ripping him apart as well with that bleed effect. The one thing you want to watch in this mission is your weapon durability because I have jumped up back up onto the obelisk when I've done this before and I haven't picked up a weapon and my durability have run out so I was sitting up here waiting for the next wave to start and I didn't have a weapon so then I had to jump down grab a weapon and somehow get back up anyway it's nearly over on Gamma you don't get the greatest items but you can get blueprints from there so not all bad there we go it's just taking the minions out now anyway that's the end of this video that's the glitch if you found this helpful please leave a like please subscribe to my channel it really helps me out and i'll see you on my next video